Hello, I'm Dr. Janine Hopkins. As a board certified dermatologist, skin cancer detection and prevention is one of my most important responsibilities. Squamous cell carcinoma is the second most common skin cancer, typically starting as a precancerous lesion referred to in dermatology as actinic keratosis. These precancerous lesions are rough, scaly, flat, pink to tan, usually on sun damaged areas of the skin. Often patients say they notice that these places flake off but always come back again in the same place. Actinic keratosis represents areas of damage in the epidermal layer of the skin. Basically, the unhealthy cells are replicating too quickly because of mutations most often caused from long-term sun damage. If precancerous lesions occur in the mouth or on the lips, it can be the result of exposure to nicotine and tobacco carcinogens. If precancerous lesions occur in the genital area, human papillomavirus infections are likely the cause. Detection and treatment in the early precancerous stage can prevent progression to cancer. However, if untreated squamous cell carcinoma develops in the tissue, eventually becoming an invasive cancer. If diagnosed at this stage, these cancers can be treated with surgical excision or certain types of chemotherapy cream. But if not treated early, risk for spread to lymph nodes, especially for squamous cell carcinomas on the lips, ears, or head and neck area, increase. Also, please consider having a thorough full body skin exam as early detection is your best defense. Remember, it's important. Be healthy, be beautiful. Hopkins Dermatology.